Hello, this is Valerie at My Scrap Chick, and today I'm going to show you how we put together this new swing card. It's the Birdhouse Swing Card, and this week only, it's also a Freebie Friday. After the Freebie Friday expires, then you can purchase it for $2 a piece, or you could also get it during one of the dollar sales for a dollar when you buy five items. So let me get started with this. It's um, here we have all the pieces laid out. Let me separate them here. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to fold the card. And I don't know if you can see here, we've got score lines along here and here. And then these pieces are cut. So what we want to do is we'll fold this along the score lines here and that will leave this cut out. So we'll fold there and then we turn it over to the front and there's two more score lines right here and we fold it like that and we crease really well and that gives you the base for the swing card now we're going to put the front the front of the card the house is going to go here so that when it's closed you'll see the front and then when you open it we'll put the inside greeting in here. So to get started though, I'm going to put the layers on first that go around the edges. And just run some quick adhesive around the edges of the paper there. And then when we go to line it up, it, this was going to leave a slight border around the outside edge, but it will butt right up against the cut edge on the inside of the card along here. And so we'll glue that down and then we'll do the other side. And if you open up the PDF, uh, it shows you all the parts and pieces and it labels them, gives you any tips and tricks that you might need to know about. Okay, and so along here, again, the cut lines are here. And we're gonna line right up along that. And it, this edge will be up along the fold line and it will leave the border all the way around on the sides. I think I'm gonna go ahead and put the fence piece on first too, since we have it open and nice and flat. And I have a short little piece of fence that goes on this side, and the one edge will go right up against the fold. And then made another fence piece that goes on the inside. Okay, and that, this shorter fence post will line right up along the cut side. Press that down, and then when it's closed, it'll look like this. And I think I'll go ahead and put the back inside part on now too. I made this special. I'm going to be sending it to my sister. It says, tweet, just sending a smile to say hi to one of my favorite peeps. We have some other greetings inside on the PDF, too. There's one for uh, somebody with a new home. And there's another one for a birthday. Okay, so that there, when that card is opened, you'll see that greeting. Before I place the house on here, I'm going to put all the pieces together. And this is the backing for all the, the front pieces. And just run some adhesive around there. There will be a slight black border. So all of the outline there of the black should be pretty even. Place that on. And then I'm going to place leaves on next that's going to go kind of randomly there on this card I actually played weighted and I put the flower on first and then I added the leaves afterwards but I'm going to do it this way too to show you there's two different ways the leaves are pretty flexible as far as how you want to place them 
So we'll do that. And then I'll add the roof. It's going to line up along on the yellow. There you have your roof. And then I'll add the little flower around the entrance to the birdhouse. And those two circles will line up. And last, I do have this little tiny circle that's going to go around and trim around the birdhouse hole there. Okay, there you have the birdhouse. One thing you could do, you can either glue it straight onto here or you could also pop dot it. But I'm gonna be putting this in the mail, so I think just to make things easy and a nice flat mailer, I'm just gonna go ahead and glue this to the card. And so I have the card folded the way it's gonna be when it's folded shut. And then I just go in here and line up the birdhouse. And place that on there. There you have. One thing that's really nice is these do go together very quickly. This is the greeting. And like I said, there's a few different ones in the PDF with this that you can choose from. You could also, and I included the cut lines for both what you see with the tweet here and with the inside um, message message layer so like if you wanted to pull that into any of your softwares and actually cut or excuse me yeah you would cut it but we, you could also add your own greeting if you have something and have your cutting machine draw the greeting right onto it and I just made one goof right here I only really wanted to put glue on one half of this because it's going to go across and be placed right on this fold line here. So I really should have only had glue on one half of this tag. When I'm all done, I could take an eraser and erase the dried glue. That will help. Okay, so place that there. So that way when the card opens, the message is kind of hanging over the side. And there you have your tweet swing, excuse me, <laughs> your birdhouse swing card. Thanks for watching. I hope you'll pick it up while this is a freebie. It's a great deal.